Hello everyone and welcome back to another Remnant 2 guide video. There are two endings in the Forgotten Kingdom DLC that result in two possible weapon rewards, the Mirage melee weapon and the Monolith gun, and I'm going over how to get both, but you will need to do two playthroughs in order to get them. Let's take a look. Now in order to get them, it's pretty straightforward. You have to do the ending twice, but other than that there's nothing else much to do. The quest Return to Lydusa begins after picking up the Cherished Fracture from the altar inside the Pan statue in the Luminous Veil vale right at the end of the DLC, which is part of the Cursed Quest. After picking it up, you locate the elevator behind the altar, and using it will take you to the outside part of the Bloodless Throne. Now all you have to do is give the fracture to Lydusa here, and you will fight her in this mutated form, and after defeating her you'll be awarded with a material used to craft the monolith weapon, and that's essentially the end of the DLC. So that is the first one, and it's pretty straightforward. However, instead, you don't have to present the Cherished Fracture to Ledusa here. You can look for her in Goddess's Rest, which is located across the Pan statue. You can go here by using the checkpoint to travel to Lambent Pass, and one of the doors in the pass will lead to an area called the Goddess's Rest. Make your way through the rest until you reach the beacon here. This, after activating it, will help to unlock the door shown below, and you must find four other beacons in order to fully unlock the door. Simply head left and right of the door in order to find them. They're not difficult to spot, but it will take you a little bit in order to get them, which, after doing so, the door will open. Inside there is a bowl, you can use the Cherished Fracture here to get a different ending and a material that is used to craft the Mirage melee weapon. That then guys is how to get the two possible weapons from the two possible DLC endings in The Forgotten King. Guys I'm finding all the secrets in the new Remnant 2 DLC so like and subscribe for more similar guides and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Did you bring me? Uh-huh, okay.